Hello, hello. And welcome back once again to Sapienza. And this time it's Landslide. Uh, today we're going to take care of the Piano Man Challenge. Um, basically, we will also get a Silent Assassin suit only for this as well, including the uh, no evidence. So we'll, we'll pick up all of these along the way. Uh, I also want to point out to uh, many of the early challenges like Piano Man, Tasteless, Traceless, um, Someone Could Hurt Themselves. A lot of these will follow the exact same route. So from the, the start right off the bat what we're going to do is make our way into the crypt under the church. We're going to lock pick the, the crypt door here. And once inside we're going to grab the crowbar that's on this tomb and these coins as well. And these will all come in useful, you'll see. And we're now going to press ourselves against the crypt wall door here. We're going to open the door, select our coins and throw a coin into the crypt. And usually it's the second coin that gets the guy. Uh, hey, just saw you do it. So if it was bad, there's a witness. So there you go, like, he, he doesn't seem to react to the first coin, but he does for the second. Huh. Like so the we're going to just grab, punch the subdue button as he comes to the door, pull him through the door, knock him out. We're going to select our crowbar, make our way through the door to our right and into the priest's cell, where we will take out the cameras. And we're going to make our way up the stairs and into the church area itself. And we're going to stop just here, just before the last flight of stairs. And as you can see, there is a church staff member mopping the floor. But he will eventually put down that mop and he will walk to the far wall with his back to us. Giving us the opportunity to sneak up the stairs, sneak up behind him, knock him out and hide his body in this convenient crate right here and then we're just going to turn on this tap to our left and run back down the stairs to where we were hiding before and we're going to wait for the other church member to go through his routine he's actually in the the church area you can see him just sweeping the floor there uh, he's going to go and do a couple of little bits and pieces and then he's going to stand on the other side of the door and he will then notice the water dripping and he will come in to clean it up and we can then take care of him as well now as I was saying at the beginning many of these challenges involve the exact same routine so when we get to the tower I recommend dropping a save because we can take care of quite a number of these routines without having to keep going through it so if you drop a save when you're at the top of the tower, I'll tell you when's the best. You can do quite a number of these challenges in oh, one run through. Damn it, damn it, damn it. So our uh, victim has arrived. He's going to now start oh. cleaning up the mess. And when he finishes, we can knock him out. We want him to clean up the mess, though. Yeah. So once he's finished cleaning the mess, we can knock him out, hide his body in the crate as well. And we're now free to make our way through the church and out the main door. And we're going to just stop at the main door and await our target. Now at this point, that is your target, Marco Abiati. We're going to wait for a audio cue, which you can barely detect. I've, I've turned the audio up as best I can, but you're waiting for him to say, you know where to find me, and he whispers it, so you may not hear it. So he's going to say it now. But when he says that, we want to run back into the church. As I heard, as you can see, it was barely audible. And we want to run up to the organ and play the organ and lock pick the door to our left and run out the back of the church now playing the organ will attract the priest 
who is currently up upstairs somewhere in the tower and he will come down to see what the noise is about and he will bump into our target and they will have their conversation eventually they will make their way up this tower which we are climbing up the drain pipe of now again at this point this is roughly where we're gonna have our save drop I won't be doing it in this video I'm gonna have to make a video for each and every one of these but essentially like I said many of these videos will Im entail pretty much the exact same thing up to this point so uh, once we're up here we're gonna select our fiber wire and we're gonna dangle over the edge and we're gonna wait for our target to arrive this is the point when our target arrives I would recommend dropping the save so that you're able to take care of a number of challenges up here like straight shot and someone could hurt themselves tasteless traceless there's a whole load of them you can do church behind me we can make this town great so we just gotta wait for this conversation to play out yes but can you imagine if it was better I mean these old houses they they are worthless people want internet and cable TV and houses that don't rot you really believe this don't you no just Trabiani. But the middle class have joined the middle class. The rich doesn't want rustic, they want modern. And that is what we will give them, if the church will help. We both know they like it. You're you insane. <laughs> Self-righteous idiots. Please, come out. Oh. oh, you always were a bore. But everyone out there will be homeless. People will vote for you. They'll get hate, Padre. It's called progress! Something your church has never understood. Huh? No, 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 no. I will... I'll break my oath of silence, huh? I'll expose you for the fraud you really are. How about that? Oh, really? Really? You're threatening me? Well, let me tell you. You are not going to say a word. You know why? Because you are nothing. Oh, no. Nothing worth living. Alright, so once Ab Abirati, or whatever his name is, has pushed the priest over the edge, we can vault over the parapet, pull out our fiber wire, sneak up behind him, Target down. and head eliminate him. So there you go. That will get you the Piano Man challenge. So we're going to vault back over and back down the drain pipe the same way we came in. Well, the same way we went up. And we're going to run to our left. There are usually cameras over here, which is why we took them out earlier. And we're going to make our way round to the left. Round by this blue van. And just down here by this souvenir shop, we'll find a set of keys on the floor. That's the speedboat keys. And we're going to use the speedboat exit because it's the nearest exit. Or it feels the nearest exit. There are, only, I think, there's only three exits on the map. Two of them are locked. In. We've just got to make our way right over to the pier at the far end of the map. Well, did you know just running through the tunnel and down onto the jetty down here, where we will find our speedboat waiting for us. So there you go, that's the Excellent. Piano Man challenge completed, along with the Silent Assassin suit only, and everything associated with that. Many of these challenges will be Silent Assassin suit only runs. That is the glorious thing about this level. I have been Anubis, I will see you all in the next video.